Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I decided I was going to give you my morning skincare routine. Um, right now I have a naked face. The only thing I've done is wash my face and this was the, is with the Tula Probiotic Skincare. This is the Purifying Face Cleanser. I... It's a face cleanser. It's not my favorite, but it's not the worst thing in the world, but I'm just going to use this up since I have it. So that's the only thing that I've done so far is wash my face and put clothes on, obviously. The next thing that I do is I put on some, like, some type of lip gloss or chapstick, not really lip gloss, like nourishing, like, oils or whatnot. And the one that I have really been enjoying for several, several months is by Algenis. This is the um, Liquid Collagen Lip. And I just put some on so my lips are nice and moisturized. And this tip on this is really cold, so it's very soothing. And I just kind of slap that on. Next, what I do is I tone my skin, and I've currently been using the Moon Juice, the Beauty Shroom. And I put it on one of these Shiseido cotton squares, and you just sprinkle it on there. there. And then I tone my face. I do go over my eyes because um, this doesn't burn the skin, but if you're using a super exfoliating toner, I would not take this over your eyes or even on the delicate under eye part. And then I take that down my chin and I also go behind my ear right here because that, sometimes that gets neglected, you know? And then I let that kind of dry on my face. And while that's drying, I like to use this roller by Nurse Jamie, and I just like to roll it. This only takes like a few seconds. You don't have to be super precise with it. I definitely like to roll through here to take away some of the inflammation, and I like to do it under my eyes, especially under my eyes. I like to do this. And this is very cold, so it's gonna help reduce the puffiness under your eyes. And however much time you have in the morning, you can just do this very quickly. Or if you really want to take your time, if you are, it's like a weekend and you have like a special occasion that night or that day, you can do this. But I really do love this and it feels amazing. It's kind of like a little mini face massage, massage, excuse me. So this is very enjoyable. Also on the same realm of depuffing the eyes. If you do not have the roller or you do not have time to do the roller, if you feel like that's too time consuming, if I'm in a rush, I will use this. This is also by Nurse Jamie. And this I just use under my eyes. It works better if you already have your serum on. So let's go ahead and do that. For serum for my under eye, I have been using the Tom Ford Research. And this was in my favorites and I did a whole dedicated video to it. But I literally do like half a pump. That's all I'm getting on my finger and I literally will tap it into my ring finger and I'll put it under my eye here tap again in under my eye and the rest I am putting on my forehead and in between my eyes now you do not have to use the same serum that I'm using you can use any serum and if you don't have either one of these devices, you can use the trick with the Q-tip and roll it. But with this, you can have some slip and this will also help depuff your eye. This does give a vibration, so it kind of tickles your eye. And I think my battery just died. Yep, nope, there it goes. And you just depuff away. And this is kind of done, can get it done faster than the roller. So I really do love these two. I think this one is more cost effective than this one and think this is just roller so it's physical this one's going to take a battery so if that's something you're weighing or use the q-tips next what I do now that I've kind of put my serum on and I've hydrated my under eyes I will put on either my moisturizer or face oil I have gone back to this herbivore emerald this is the cannabis hemp oil moisturizer now I absolutely hate the smell of this stuff I, I cannot stand the smell but it does do a very good job of hydrating so I'm just gonna do mm, four drops and I rub it and then I pat it oh god this stuff stinks 
I say that every time I put it on my face. It stinks, but thankfully, the smell goes away very quickly. And I'm also kind of weird, I don't like to put anything on my face that I'm rubbing when I have rings and jewelry and stuff on, so I always remove my jewelry. So next up, now that I've done that, another new item I've been using is this um, new brow to help my eyebrows grow back. So I just pop this on, it's clear, and just focusing it on the places that I want my hair to come back. Um, since I've been using this part of my eye has really started to fill in. So now I'm really focusing on the front part of my brow. Next, what I do is I use some type of hand cream, whether it's by Aveda or the Hydro Boost. I always put a hand cream on and your hands are kind of already moisturized because we use that oil on our face. But I still love to put moisturizer on my hands just because it's winter time and your skin needs extra hydration. So that's what I do. I put this on my hands, I put my jewelry back on. And my final step before I, if I'm doing no makeup, of course if I was doing makeup, I would put this on, but I'm just sticking with skincare and since it's the weekend and I'm recording this, I don't have any makeup on currently. So the last step, if I'm just going to be bare face and rock what, you know, what I was given, I use a sunscreen. Even though it's the wintertime, people kind of neglect using sunscreen, but you need to use your sunscreen. And I really do like this Pixie, the Sun Mist. It has um, SPF 30 and it's a spray. I'm enjoying the spray more than the creams. So, and I just spray my face and I usually spray my ears. And then I kind of just fan it so it dries quickly. And then with that lip gloss, I kind of run it over to get it off of my lips. And then I will go about my day. Sometimes, especially in the summertime, if I want double coverage with sunscreen, I will do this and then spray it again on top once my makeup is applied. But yeah, guys, that is my everyday skincare routine, especially during the winter. You do not have to use the same products that I'm using use whatever um, cleanser you want, whatever moisturizer, whatever serum, whatever you want. And I will let you know that with that sunscreen, it's gonna make your face very uh, glowy. So you can powder on top of it. I have put makeup on top of this, but I'm just not doing that today because I'm gonna do some chores around the house. But yeah, guys, that is it for today's video. That is my morning routine. If you have any questions, please leave them down below. Don't forget to subscribe. There's a button right down here. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys.